Uh, good evening, Portland. Good evening, St. John's. Evening. How are you? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Bring out such uh, old napkins. I was like, I could, man, I wish I had a napkin. So I'm about to use like five or six more of these easily. <laughs> and I haven't even got up, you know, like I just got up here. And here I am. I'm already a freaking, I'm already melting. What have you guys done to me? I have a thing with uh, that feeling before you fall in love with somebody. You know that feeling? It's called liking them. Yes. <laughs> it's pretty sweet. Uh, I wrote this for a gal. <laughs> Many years ago. In that moment where you think, oh, you know what I'm going to do? You know, you know how I'm going to tell her I like her? I'm going to write it in a poem. <laughs> I'm going to write it in a poem, an okay one. And then I'll, I'll present it to her alone uh, in a living room. And then she will fall in love with me right then and there. <clears throat> this is exactly how I performed it for her the very first time I ever read it out loud. <clears throat> I like you, the way I like my wonton packed full of shrimp, like too much syrup on my, my pancakes, eggs, toast, waffles, hash browns, beard, oops. I like you like blue whales like to say, I like you like a whole bunch of a lot and a whole pocket full of awesome. I like you not unlike Texans like Texas. Like fat kids like cake. Like two likes three and four likes six because five has issues. Like tuna sandwiches like teeth. Like cherry flavored Slurpees like to wash down convenience store nachos. Like lazy boys like Sunday afternoon asses. I like you a whole bunch of a lot and a little bit more. You're a bottomless basket full of crispy extra french fries covered in awesome sauce. I like you similar to the way pirates and frat boys like booty. <laughs> like newlyweds like holiday inns. Like bohemians, yuppies, and the Japanese like sushi. Like David Copperfield likes performing grand scale, yet lame-ass feats of illusion. <laughs> like the U.S. government likes performing grand scale, yet lame-ass feats of illusion. <laughs> like testicles and homeboys like to hang. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> right. Like homeless people and break dancers like cardboard. Aww. There's always a groan. There's always a groan. Time out, real quick. Teach them to break dance, right? <laughs> and I'll make way more money, right? <laughs> That's great. Time in. Back to the yeah, is, right? <laughs> Free break dancing classes for the homeless. Uh, but I do say, I do say, houseless though. The houseless. Uh, uh, time out again. Uh, because really, when you think about it, a home is not a building. It's not a structure. A home is 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 a, is a feeling, you know. And so, anyway, time time it back to phone. <laughs> I like you like Americans like ranch dressing, which is nasty, right? Time out. Time out, real quick. Um, <laughs> if you love ranch dressing and you want a, a way of making it cheaply, making it inexpensively, uh, take a baby. Uh, breastfeed it for about 20 minutes, and then just give it a little shake, too, like, not like brain damagey, you know, uh, and just but let it barf all over your chicken strips, and then add salt and pepper to taste. Boom, ranch. <laughs> Same thing. Time in, back to the poem. I like you like Muppets like fisting. Like, okay, come on guys. Time out, real quick. <laughs> you really that surprised? <laughs> Time in. <laughs> <laughs> I like you a whole bunch of a lot and a whole lot more times infinity and maybe that's starting to dip into the equation of love. Nevertheless, I got a thing for you, like magnets got it for refrigerators. I'm stuck on you. And I like it. I like you an official metric buttload. I think you're a body full of soul and I hope you like me back. Even if it's like dust likes furniture, at least you're all over me. And I'm making a pledge. Is it, thank you. Because I guess I'm just tired of meeting people who define themselves by what they don't like. I just don't like that. But I do like holding you. 
The way your pillow holds your head when you sleep. The way gay, lesbian, transgender, transsexual, Irish, and Mexican people hold parades. <laughs> the way the earth holds the moon and the sun holds the earth and how they will constantly spin around each other forever. I know that metaphor doesn't really make a whole lot of sense with regard to this poem because that would imply that there were three of us. Which could also be awesome. <laughs> you get the idea. In my book, you rock and I like rocks. Anyhow, just because I spent an hour or so writing this down doesn't mean you have to like me back. But damn it, I would really like that. Thank you. All right. Uh, and this is a brand new-ish breakup poem. <clears throat> it's called Always. But it's one of those, you know, where it's like, yeah, you just really want it to be way more hopeful than it ends up being sometimes. So I was trying to make it better, you know. <clears throat> uh, I was actually inspired by a track by uh, Stevie Ray Vaughan at the end of his album, Tex 